Welcome to Curatorial Curiosities, a series that explores what is currently fascinating the staff of the Nashville Parthenon. I'm Jennifer Richardson, the Education and Curatorial Assistant. As I was combing through the archives, I came across some notes that had been made regarding the Tennessee Centennial Exposition and the James M. Cowan Collection of American Art. The Tennessee Centennial Exposition was a six-month-long festival held in 1897 to celebrate the statehood of Tennessee and raise awareness of all the state's accomplishments. The Parthenon is the centerpiece of what has come to be known as Centennial Park and was the pride of the exposition. It represented Nashville as the Athens of the South and housed the largest art exhibit ever seen in the southern United States. Curious to find out more about how the art currently on display at the Parthenon connected to the exposition, I went to our registrar with a request to pull the Tennessee Centennial Exposition Art Catalog from Art Storage. Luckily, this book is now available online for you to view too. I'll include a link in the notes below. As I skimmed through this catalog, I saw many artists who are represented in the Cowan Collection but the one that stood out the most was John George Brown. Brown served on the jury appointed to select art from New York to be displayed at the Tennessee Centennial Exposition. Known as J.G. Brown, he was quite famous in the late 1800s, even coming to be known as the Boot Black Raphael due to his many paintings of young boys working in urban settings. The Young Musician in the Cowan Collection is a prime example of his work. Brown was well represented at the Tennessee Centennial Exposition. With nearly 1,000 paintings on display, he had five exhibited, an honor only surpassed by two other painters. Herman Justy, the editor of the official history of the exposition, tells us that Heels Overhead was overwhelmingly voted the most popular painting. Brown's other works included The Gang, A Joint Investment, The Longshoreman's Noon, which had previously received an honorable mention at the Paris Salon and is currently part of the National Gallery of Arts collection in Washington, D.C., and finally, the last edition. We have a full inventory of paintings that were on display, but only a few photographs of the exhibit. Luckily, we can catch a glimpse of the last edition here. James M. Cowan spent his boyhood in Tennessee, but moved near Chicago to make his fortune and build an impressive art collection. He returned to Tennessee in 1897 with the Armor Drill Corps of Chicago to accompany them for their performance at the exposition. He was overcome with fondness for Tennessee and received such a warm welcome that in the 1920s, he decided to quietly donate 63 paintings to be displayed at the Parthenon. A selection of these paintings, including the young musician, is on display and waiting for you. Come visit us and follow your own curiosities at the Nashville Parthenon.